I'm John Zuccarelli. I'm the commander in charge of low voltage fuse removal and the Safe Work at Heights project. This project uh, is looking after low voltage fuse removal from the conception, from training, right through to the equipment and where it will be placed and used out into the field. That's the same for Safe Work at Heights. So low voltage fuse removal is uh, the CFA's ability to disconnect supply when safe to do so and safe work at heights is CFA's ability to work off roofs safely uh, which is a requirement for, from WorkSafe. Our packages have been built by our subject matter experts in the field and it has been endorsed by Energy Safe Victoria and endorsed by WorkSafe which is a really positive step for us to, to move through. The project team is currently rolling out training and low voltage fuse removal has been rolled out to 82 brigades uh, with uh, about 25 brigades to go in stage one and uh, which is about 420 members that have been currently trained or will be trained in the stage one process. The prerequisites for low voltage fuse removal are the, is the electrical awareness safety package that can be delivered either face to face or can be delivered by the learning management system. Safe work at heights uh, will be rolled out very shortly. So currently the package is being finalised and will go out to consultation and we've targeted uh, 32 brigades. Now with both packages they will be delivered to a class five, four and three brigades with ones and twos being selected at a needs basis by the operational manager. The beauty about these packages, it gives us the ability to work safely wherever we need to do so. So in the low voltage fuse removal space, we can actually disconnect supply, work safely and then hand over to the power company. And with the safe work at heights, we can operate off a roof without the risk of falling off. And it also gives us the ability to do a dynamic risk assessment, whether we perform the task or we don't. So it really gives us, it increases our ability to understand the conditions that we work in. Once you, you have the qualification in low voltage fuse removal and work safe work at heights, there is a three year recurrency. And what that means is that every three years, you'll need to come back and redo the skill but coupled on with that, there will also be changes because as the industry changes in the electrical world, that we are able to pick up those changes and incorporate them into the package. With Safe Work at Heights, there is also a three year recurrency. The Safe Work at Heights training is a two day course, uh, which incorporates all the prerequisites delivered on the day. And after the second day, you'll be qualified in uh, Safe Work at Heights. Low voltage fuse removal, once the prerequisites are done, it is a one day course that's approximately four to six hours of theory and then a four to two hours of the fuse removal process. And once that's completed, the equipment will be sent out to the brigades and the minimum numbers for brigades to be trained in low voltage fuse removal is four members per brigade and then the kit will be sent. And for Safe Work at Heights, it's a minimum of five members per brigade we're looking at a target audience of a roughly about 20 people per brigade for each discipline. So it gives us flexibility and it doesn't, also, it doesn't put the burden on the members that are trained. But this is in stage two and stage three rollouts, which will be in the next couple of years.